Okay, the clock was telling us we needed to let y'all know how to order again. I need this information if you want to um, order uh, under these videos. After I save the price, make a comment in the comment section with a timestamp of the item that you want. And I don't know where the timestamp thing went. You don't know either. There it is. There you go. Make a comment with a timestamp. That's the minute and second, and a description of the item that you're looking at. Send me an email at myskywatch2 at gmail.com. Um, I need your PayPal email, your shipping address, your YouTube name, your name if it's different from your YouTube name, so I can connect the two. We ship only in the U.S., and shipping is $5 flat rate no matter how much you order. So, and don't forget to get a piece of paper here. And then for invoicing, we invoice at the first of the month or at a hundred dollars once you reach a hundred dollars. If you're a big spender, that hundred dollars make sure everything is insured when it's mailed to you. If you haven't reached a hundred dollar by the first of the month, we'll go ahead and invoice you anyway, or um. We can also invoice you immediately if you want it right then after you've said you wanted it. You just need to let me know in your email when you send me your information. But it's it's invoicing on the first of the month or reaching $100 in sales, whichever comes first. So if the first of the month comes and you don't have $100, you're still going to get an invoice. If during that same month, say February the 1st, you get an invoice, and by the 20th of February, you've ran up another bill of $100, you're going to get another invoice. So it's whether it's the first of the month or $100. Hope that's clear. Now, let's get back to what we were doing when I heard the clock ringing, I knew I needed to stop. We're looking at this. It's precious moments. Let heaven and nature sing. It's um, a 1992 Sam Samuel J. Butcher. So it's, it's vintage. It's very sweet. It's on a ribbon. It's $5 if anybody wants it. Very sweet. The next one we have is this pretty one. I'm not sure what it means. It looks like a child sitting on top of a hill or praying. And then it's got hot peppers. That's, I don't know. But it's a cute little necklace. Here's the back. It is magnetic. That is magnetic. So we're going to do this one for $2. Okay. The next one is really pretty. It goes at the base of the neckline. It's a Charmin Charlie's. Lobster claw clasp with an extender with the bead. Little curved textured links with rhinestone spacers in there. All the rhinestones are here. Let me check for sure. Get it all turned around here. Yes, they're all there. Let me put it on sky here just so you can get an idea what it looks like. As long as I get it turned around. Okay, there we go. It's very pretty. That's what it looks like. The metal's in excellent condition. This is $2. 
see how long it is, just so you'll know. I'm going to measure it with the extender. Okay, this is a very long necklace. It's a Claire's. It's got, boys, these don't feel cold. That could be the metal I'm feeling. No. No, they're not glass. Okay, these are acrylic. It's brass. It's got faux pearls, acrylic beads, and it goes down here. It's an odd necklace. There we go. It's layered here. You've got a little heart. It's really a nice little necklace. Very long, though. We're going to do this one for $2. Next one is, looks like it's got a tiger eye in the center. It's a cord, it's on a cord. It's, it's magnetic, yes. All right, and it is a lobster claw clasp. Very pretty little necklace, two dollars. Next is Lobster Claw Class Extender with a Faux Pearl. This is a copper looking chain. It's got pearl and fasted beads. I love this, the capping of these pearls on that. This is a filigree bead. There you go again. Goes on down to that one. It's very pretty. These are two dollars. If anybody wants it. The next one is I don't know who that is. I know somebody's told me. Lobster claw clasp. Beautiful necklace with pearls and rhinestones. Very pretty. Got it on here. Oh yeah, that's gorgeous. Very pretty. And there's nowhere on the back. There's no missing stones. I'm gonna do this for five dollars. Very beautiful. We have a star anklet here. Very nice chain. It's got a spring ring clasp. I don't see any markings on it. It's got textured and then the shiny star in the middle. Very cool anklet. I'm going to do this for $3. Here's a little necklace, that, I mean bracelet. Some cool jewels with little tiny um, dolphins in pink. Looks like an anklet also. It's pretty big. Oh. Oh, necklace I can get 
see. No, I got it all tangled up. <clears throat> okay, this is an anklet. We're going to do it for a dollar. Cool jewels. Very cute. Next one is a Shambhala bracelet. Very pretty. These are glass beads. I love this. Love the. This feels like silk threading there. I don't know if that's true or not. Very pretty. This one is three dollars. Beautiful. Here we have the tree of life. What was that? The trash can. You bumped oh. it or did something. Tree of life. A little stretchy. Two dollars. Here is we have stone in here. I don't think I don't think those are glass. But stone in here. This is aluminum wiring. I'm gonna put that in the hobby lot. Here's a little necklace that you can, that's got just a little circle dangling down on it. It's a choker style. It's a dollar. I did that one too, I think for a dollar. Okay. We have a little toe ring. Cute little stones in there. It is magnetic. We'll do the toe ring for a dollar. So next is, I love this necklace, is a 80R. So I don't know what that is. And it's a Y necklace, but it's layered with these two additional chains. It goes to that Y. It's very pretty on the neck. Very dainty. Very pretty look. Very elegant look. This one is three dollars. No wear on it. Again, it's in excellent condition. The next one we have is one of these that roll on the neck as you wear it. It's on a rope chain, spring ring clasp. It looks vintage to me. I love that. All your little rhinestones are there. It is magnetic. We'll go $3 on that one. The next is Hope and a Little Feather. That's a gold tone feather. Here's the Hope. Rollo chain in excellent condition. Spring ring clasp. Very cute. A dollar. Kiss me. Okay. <laughs> so, it is American Eagle Outfitters, AEO. It's got a, lot, a spring ring class with an extender. It's very cute. Be great for um, Valentine's. We're going to do $3 on that. Yeah. Don't have to threaten me with a good time. <laughs> Behave yourself. The next one we have is this bar necklace. Very pretty. Gold tone, extender. I'm not sure what this mark is either. So this may be a bargain alert for somebody. Let's see if y'all know what it is. Kind of looks like a mermaid. Mermaid. Yeah, mermaid. 
I don't know anything about it. It's not magnetic. Mm. Is it gold? We're going to find out. Oh no, that's copper based. Nope, it's not gold, but it's gold tone now. Copper base, very pretty little necklace. It's a minimalist with a little bling. Minimal bling. We're going to do this one for $3. Very pretty. Another nice layering piece, too. So we've got these two bracelets. First we have this one with the loop and it's got a hammered look. It's in good shape. And then we have this one with these little cabochons with rhinestones. Oh no, this one's got missing rhinestones. This one's going in the Hobby Lot. It's got tiny little missing rhinestones. This one we will sell for a dollar. It's very pretty. It's very cool. I would buy it for a dollar. See, that looks great on the hand. And it fits well, too. It's not a circle. It's an oval. And it fits your wrist better. And it's easy to open. That's really a nice one. I should have charged you more, but I didn't. Okay. <laughs> All right, we have... Yes. I'm just going to bring the big sky right on over. I got you all separately. No, you got it backwards, too. I will do that. I'm going to show these separately. Now this is a brand I am familiar with. It's called Handmade in the USA. And it's Lizzie James. It's got the beautiful heart uh, lobster claw claps. This is a dark green cord with curved beads you can find you can go look this up we are going to sell this one for 15 let me show it to you as soon as I get it down here not up there I think they're supposed to be kind of separated out yeah There it is. This is Lizzie James. These are not magnetic. I don't know if they're silver now, that I don't know. No, they're copper based. But this is a beautiful brand. It's well made and well marked. Pretty necklace. That one's 15. Now, here, you can take that one. Thank you. The next one is also a Lizzie James. It's a double stranded one. Lizzie James again, made in America. There's your lobster claw. They're absolutely beautiful. Beautiful cording on this is teal in color. So it's got your Caribbean color. Your little stone right there. And did I get it? Nope, I didn't get it right either, honey. Right there with you. Is 
is pretty though. This is the other one. And you see the dragonfly and the little stone there at the top. That's a glass crystal. It is beautiful. Let me give you a closer look on that. Look at the cut on that. It's got a flat, it's like a Rivoli, but it's flat on the very top there. So that's a very different cut. This one is, we're going to sell this one for 30 No. I'm sorry. We're selling this one for 25 The other one for 15 If you buy both, you get, no. Yeah, yeah. No. If you buy both of these, you'll get them for 35 Or you can buy them separate and just buy this one for 25 or buy the other one for 15 Very pretty. Very unique design. Okay. Is that it, honey? No, we got earrings. Oh, my goodness. Well, you can Go I gotta go through them and I'll be right back. Okay, I got the earrings out. We have first pair of these uh, enamel earrings. They're in excellent condition. Two dollars. They're vintage. Have some more enamel and stone. Now the backs are not in excellent condition here and they'll be replaced. I've taken them off now. But the back of the earring is in excellent shape. And here's the front. It's enamel and rhinestones. Those are two dollars. The next are these lightweight post earrings. You'll get new backs. I believe they're paper with um, polyurethane over the top. They're very beautiful. That one goes there. Very pretty. And here's the backs. Two dollars. Got some pretty little hoops. Silver tone, I suppose. I haven't tested anything. Right here. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, slightly magnetic. These are very nice, very pretty design. Just needs a little bit of cleaning up. Two dollars. And the next are these little netted pearls. <clears throat> and then pearl and feels like glass bead dangles. Let me test them. let you guys see once in a while. Be nice. Nope. Oh, wait a minute. Yep. Yeah. yeah, these are glass. And these? Oh, man. They're glass, you can feel they're cold. They're the same as this larger bead here. So you've got this, two dollars. The next are these vintage earrings that are very pretty with the moon globe chocolate brown stones. They are clips. They are not marked. And they are three dollars. Here's some little artisan earrings for a dollar. Very um, done on aluminum. It's very cool. Lighthouses. Backings out. How much say this is for? 
dollar. Okay. Probably worth more than that, but let's okay. see what these are. Yeah, these are not magnetic. They've got that Indian style look. And they look like they may be silver. Very silver. So these are nine dollars. They're hoops. Very pretty hoops. Pretty weighty too. The next ones we have are these beautiful little crystals. This has got the AB wash here on these. And also these. With the clear ones also have an AB. This looks like brass bindings here. Lever backs. Oh yeah, that's not magnetic. Three dollars. Very beautiful. Pretty little pearl earrings. Rhinestones up here at the top at the ear, which makes it nice. Um, They're not magnetic. They are copper based, but very beautiful. Love the pearls, the champagne colored pearls. And rhinestones, $3. They look like they've never been worn. The next are these beauties. You've got these uh, cat's eye beads. Very pretty, very cold. Silver tone here. Let's see if those are. Oh, yeah, they're magnetic. These are very pretty in the blue. Two dollars. We have these big teardrops in gold tone with the rhinestones. These have AB washes on them. The rest are white clear, and this is a pinkish colored, champagne colored. Here's the back. Shepherd's hooks. These are in good condition. They're three dollars. The next are these gunmetal and silver tone. And they are very nice uh, hooks on these French wires. Here's your their silver tone and gunmetal. Multiple little Loops. Wait a minute. Let me get this on. Where's my little stick? There it is. It's hard to show them otherwise. And they're magnetic. Very pretty. Nowhere. Three dollars. These are beautiful. Look at the AB wash on those. They are brass. They have a signature on them. Liz Palacios. Yeah, Liz Palacios. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Very beautiful. These are, are $12. In an excellent condition. There you go. Just gorgeous. Gorgeous on the ear. <clears throat> the next one 
or stone. I don't know what kind of stone this is. But I see some red and white and gray or green. I'm not sure. Here's the other one. They're very cold. I don't think they're magnetic. Oh yeah, they are. Yes. Very pretty stone earring, six dollars. Here's the backs. Uh -oh. Okay, we have these. I'm taking these off. We need new ones. They turn yellow. These are threader earrings. Very beautiful. These are crystals. They're very cold. Let's see if they're quartz. That would even be better. Nope, the crystal. Beautiful blue and clear stone crystals. I saw something on here. Oh. All right, we're going to go out and zoom in. Yeah, those are 925. I have it upside down. So these are silver. They're very beautiful. They are nine dollars. And I thought I had matched that again. Thought I'd pull both of them out. We have a few that didn't match, but we're keeping the ones that aren't matched till we. Uh, and find, um, make sure they don't have a match. There it is. Okay, here it is. This one also, these need to be changed out. These are threaders with crystals. And this time you have hematite and this beautiful peridot green colored Beautiful piece. Let me test this to make sure that's not peridot. No, it's just glass. Now, what do I got here? Oh. Yeah, these are threader earrings. This is what you have. And you have threader earrings. Okay, where'd the bead go? Oh, it's in my hand. Duh. Lord have mercy. And then this, and I'm missing a little silver bead. Where'd it go? Yep. That's what I'm missing. So I have to find that before I can sell these. Okay, we will put these back. Are you sure it was on there before? I don't know. I don't know. The next ones we have are these. Little smoky colored crystal drop earrings on I want to say that's silver tone it's tarnished though let me check it I think these are silver let me check this stone here Let's see if it's crystal or quartz
glass. Hmm. Okay, testing. Very silver. So these little crystal drop silver earrings, six dollars. We have this little card of earrings. We're gonna sell those for two dollars. There's your backs. The only ones that don't have a match are these, but you may have more than one ear piercing. Very pretty little colors. Two dollars, honey. Okay. These are vintage buttons. Here's the back. I'm going to sell those for a dollar. So I'll get back to you guys, or we can sell it as is. Let's sell it as is, because they can just take that little bead off if they want to. So as is, I'm going to sell these for $9. They are sterling. Just like the other threader earrings, they are marked on the stem. Right there, 925. And we will put new backs on them, but for right now I need to keep the backs on that. Okay, honey, there you go. Alrighty, that's it, isn't it? When we get this bag filled up with goodies and things uh, we're not selling, we will um, sell it. It's going to be $25 and that's going to include the shipping. And it will probably weigh six pounds before it's over with. Alright guys, um, thank you for joining us. If you like the way we're doing the the new uh, sale on the jewelry now. While we open up the jars, let us know. Give us some feedback. Uh, we appreciate you spending your time with us. Everyone have a blessed evening. And give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't subscribed uh -huh. and hit that notification bell. Good night, y'all. Good night. Bye. Hush.